this one actually ties in a little bit with sleep paralysis and stuff, which is what we've been talking about, which is nice. Lovely. So this is from Barney Holden. All right. Quality so name. That's, good. That's a solid name. Yeah. Solid. I mean, he's got a point already. Yeah. <laughs> just, no. just being called Barney Holden. <laughs> right. Uh, right. So I didn't really believe in any sort of other realm or paranormal shit until this happened. Feel free to debunk debunk it. I've tried to myself every time I recall this story. It gives me a shiver down my spine. He says, I was laying in bed a few years ago. It must have been about 15, 16 when I came from a deep sleep into a lighter one. I hadn't opened my eyes, but I had a weird feeling. It was the feeling you get when someone is behind you. You don't know who, but you just feel a certain energy. I felt that when I opened my eyes, I saw a nurse. I simply ran out of the room and slept it and slept in my mum's bed. The next day, I said, <laughs> the next day I told her about it. She laughed at me, told me it was a nightmare and to grow up. <laughs> <laughs> Classic standard. Yeah. Oh, you're 16. You got to stop sleeping with me for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> to grow up. I went to school and that's the last I thought. That's the last I thought would be told of it. When I came home, my mum told me to describe the woman specifically. I said it just looked like a woman dressed in white. She didn't look like a ghost out of a movie, uh, but there was just something off about her that wasn't human. And when I said this, the color from her face went. She then told me that she was joking to the neighbor about it. This is, uh, sorry, his mum's a savage. His face is like, grow up. Yeah, it's like, yeah. you'd never guess what that little pussy did last <laughs> night. Like, My but baby I believe son. So far, I'm like, this yeah, is all yeah. believable. Cause yeah. It's legit. So, so, so yes, yeah, so the colour from her face. She then told me that she was joking to the neighbour about it. And she told, and so she told her what I had said. Um, she was out uh, and uh, she said that she was having a cigarette in the backyard. This is the neighbour. A few nights ago. And she saw a woman that resembled a nurse exactly the way that I had described it. If this was all, I would laugh it off as a coincidence. However, I went on to discover that my street is built on the same grounds as a Victorian hospital and exactly where my house is was the entrance where the nurses would go to smoke. If you stand at the front door of my house, it will sometimes smell like cigarettes, but as strong as someone is blowing the smoke in your face. And whenever it does, there is a cold, eerie breeze. However, stepping five steps into the living room, the smell and feeling goes. Mm. And that is the story. Oh. Cool. So basically, sleep paralysis sees a nurse. Then his mum talks to the neighbour. Turns out she's seen a nurse. He does a bit of research. Turns out all the houses are literally built on the grounds mm. of a Victorian hospital. I think it's, it's pretty pretty juicy and all adds yeah. up. Yeah, yeah. Sounds, I like that. Yeah, I mean, legit. yeah, it's all, it's always like scarier when you apply history to it. Yeah, and it turns out that you know what you see, you know, coincides with something historical happening. Yeah, or being most built definitely. On the grounds of, but yeah, I, it was better than the the first one. Not to knock the first one. <laughs> not saying it was shit. Into it. <laughs> not saying it was shit, but it was better. <laughs> um, oh dear. Yeah. No, I like that. And I, 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 you're bang on with what you said. There's like that um, that story. I think it was actually then um, turned into one of the Conjuring movies or one of the Insidious movies. But it's it's a true story of this like toddler who was fascinated with this chair in the corner of the room, and then it turned out. That, yeah. like the previous occupant had died in that chair oh, or something right. like that. Um, so yeah, like you say, it's one, and he, you know, Barney said it perfectly in, in the email. It was one thing for, could be a coincidence, you know, seeing a nurse like woman with the same as the neighbor. But like you say, once you apply the history, yeah, the, the yeah it's like a spooky that story ass. is his name, Barney. <laughs> Barney Holden. <laughs> yeah. It's a legendary it's a Barney. Name. But yeah, we no, should go was... to that place. Yeah. yeah. Where, I don't know where he lives. Can we stay in your room? Stay in your attic, mate. Oh, mate we can yeah. frog you. Yeah. Yeah. Ouija board there. Yes, yeah, so I yeah, I was yeah. thinking that to go there and do a yeah. Ouija board. Yeah, hundred <laughs> percent. By yeah. the way, guys, please do let us know on all the socials and that any locations you'd like us to go to. Because, yeah. you know, there's obviously all, like, the big ones that you can Google. But I often find maybe the better ones would be the ones that have, like, the local history. Yeah. Do you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah. Like, the ones that, oh, there's this in the woods and blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So, well, yeah, do let us know. Ouija board there would be good. It'd probably spell oh, it. Yeah. A, got a light. Or something. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just Benson and Hedges. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> yeah, so what are we giving that one? An out of 10. I like that one. I thought I'll give that a nine. A nine, yeah, yeah, Barney. Because yeah. if, if I was to go and stay there, I would shit myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah 100%. I would just be thinking about this nerd. We've got to go. Yeah, yeah. No, yeah that'd be cool. Let's go. know where you live, Barney. <laughs> Well, seven. Seven. Yeah. So no, seven. Please. Can we do point a compliment. Fives? Yeah. Seven point five. Seven point five, five yeah. nine and I'm gonna go I'm gonna go eight. Eight. But I did say at the start he gets an extra, extra point, point for the name. So, so nine. nine. Oh, so you've had it on there. Yeah. Okay, so nine. Yeah. nine I'd like to know five. what the nurse looked like as well. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really slutty. Yeah, it could, yeah, yeah. It's slutty nurse. Yeah, uh, yeah. He said she didn't look human though. Yeah. Maybe like yeah, f- what, fit like, body, but just a bit. You know when you say, you know, <laughs> yeah, you've got, got, you got, you got tits where it yeah. would be. Maybe, yeah. Out of this world, <laughs> maybe you should yeah. yeah. out of context. Yeah. Yeah. She didn't look human. Yeah. Yeah. She, she was, was lovely. Yeah. Yeah. She was like a goddess. Oh, yeah. yeah, she was like a 10. Yeah. 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 Nice. She was fit as fuck, mate. Uh, she didn't uh, look human. Imagine going up to a bird saying, you don't look human. What? Slap you on the face. 10 out of 10. You're out of this world. Oh, man. But yeah, no, oh. thank you for the story, Barney. Guys, yeah. down below, please do let us know what you give that one out of 10. Mm.